She helped uncover the structure of life itself, but history almost forgot her name. Her work revealed the shape of DNA, the code that defines every living being. Others would become famous for it. She would not. Her name was Rosalind Franklin. Franklin was a brilliant chemist and X-ray crystallographer, known for her precision, discipline, and relentless focus on evidence. In the early 1950s, she was studying DNA using X-ray diffraction, a technique so complex that only a few scientists in the world truly understood it. What she captured was extraordinary. An image later known as Photograph 51, it clearly revealed the helical structure of DNA, the answer scientists had been searching for. But the image was shown to others without her permission. Her data was shared. Her conclusions were taken. Two scientists used that information to build the famous double helix model. Their names became legend. They won the Nobel Prize. Rosalind Franklin was barely mentioned. At the time, she was working in an environment that doubted her abilities, questioned her presence, and dismissed her authority. She continued her research anyway. Quietly, relentlessly, Franklin later made groundbreaking contributions to the study of viruses, work that could have earned her recognition on its own, but she never lived to see justice. Rosalind Franklin died at the age of 37 from ovarian cancer, likely caused by years of radiation exposure in the lab. When the Nobel Prize was awarded for the discovery of DNA, she was already gone. Her name was absent from the celebration. Today, scientists acknowledge what history once ignored. The structure of DNA was revealed because of her work. Life's blueprint was exposed by someone the world chose not to see.